I'm the problem. I'm the problem. I'm the problem. Why am I the problem? Try to hit me. Are you with us, group? Why don't you go get Where's Kaden? That's assault, miss. Shame on you! You're disgusting to America and to us! Hi, I'm Brian Atlas. I'm at an anti-lockdown protest here in Santa Barbara, California. I got a bunch of ridiculous protest signs that have absolutely nothing to do with the protest. We've got the science on our side. People are sick and tired of this. We know the masks don't work. We know this virus doesn't affect kids. They should be back in school. Or we just steal ourselves and we say, we're not taking this anymore. We go into the store and say, I'm sick of you. I'm sick of you telling me to suffocate myself. We're showing the world that we're not afraid to breathe the air. I went through calculus class without a calculator. Open our business! Open our business! Fuck feminism! Open our school! Open our business! Open our business! Open our business. Stop putting up Christmas signs too early! I actually kind of agree with that one. 100%! People do it way too early. Way too early, it's unacceptable. No more early Christmas decorating! So what do you think about COVID? Is it, all, is it fake? You know what I think is a hoax? Venereal disease. That's why I don't use a rubber. Like during sexual intercourse. I don't wanna to talk to you about that. You don't like sex? This is a nonpartisan issue. Whichever side of the political spectrum you're on, we can all get behind this. <laughs> Fucking crowds, man. Fuck. The last time I saw a place this crowded was Tanner Mongo's vagina. Hi, you guys. Great. What you doing here? It's a conspiracy by the handbag and purse industry. Because I was, I was against the drug war to begin with. It all started my speech. Don't tread on me. Well, don't, don't, don't tread on me, son. If you, want, if you want to do it with your own group, do it with your own group. The gay marijuana. Yeah. <laughs> Legalize gay marijuana. <laughs> marijuana is just marijuana. You've never had gay marijuana before? I've never smoked marijuana at all. Shit is fucked up, guys. It's messed up. You should show that to people. <laughs> Fuck, my arms are tired. God damn. I've been walking all day. <laughs> my arms are actually tired. What do you think of mine? Terrible. Really? I'm here for the gangbang. <laughs> That's assault, miss. Hey, why use that big sign to block the camera when you could just use your body? Hello, officers. Don't tread on me. You got a bad. Why, you got a why bad are you treading attitude? on me? Because Freedom of you're, speech. You're, you're, you're not a patriot. You're usurping our parade. No. You are. You're a problem. I'm the problem. You're a problem. problem. I'm the problem. Why am I the problem? You're camouflaged. I'm a patriot. You're not. I'm a patriot. Yeah. Well, you're exercising your right to freedom of speech. You're probably like age to be a provocateur, and you don't even understand. You know, my grandfather was put on a on transfer to a Nazi war camp at the barrel of a gun in occupied Holland. I did. They fucked up Game of Thrones season 8. It's fucking bullshit, dude. Imagine ruining the biggest intellectual property since Star Wars. I f agree a thousand percent. Game of they Thrones? Really fucked it up. He's really screwed the pooch there. David Weiss and Dan Benioff fucked Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones season 8, they fucked it up. That's what I'm out here protesting. What about you guys? Good. That, that's what this protest is. If I, they scuffed Game of Thrones? Yeah, no, I don't think so. Game of Thrones got ruined? Listen, not all of us can have giant schlongs. Shame on you! Shame on you! What's the peens? Peens! Distractors! Don't even, don't even waste your energy on Whatever! <laughs> You're disgusting to America and to us! Not all of us can have horse cocks, miss. You're allowed to have free speech! 
Bring the gymnasts, bring, you know, bring them over, why not? Uh, preferably just the women gymnasts. If they came here legally. Only legally. Friends was one of the best TV shows ever invented. And they were on the break. They were on the break, Paul. Any form of plastic surgery is kind of fucking retarded, like butt implants, breast implants. Open our businesses, for God's sake! What do you think about manlets? Like short guys? Like, would you date a short guy? Like, I think they're people too. Like, women just discriminate with height. Why? Where, where did you see, like, little person? You didn't see that dwarf, Paul, earlier? No. The, like, Mexican dwarf? What up? <laughs> okay, well, what about him? Well, I'm not like I'm not even talking about dwarfs. I'm just talking about guys who are like five seven. Okay. Like, if I will date like, one of them, yeah. Why not? Well, how tall are you? Five six. Would you date a guy who's like five four? If he, if, if he's if he's if he's if, cute, if he's believing in the right things and he's not a sheep and he's not wearing a mask, I'm sorry, I'm telling you. If I would date a man like something at least taller than me. Nobody oh, likes short people. I'm just like tired of, you know, people discriminating against short guys, like, I mean... <laughs> They're discriminating not against short. us! I'm not and short, I'm six oxygen. feet. I'm six feet, but I'm an ally. I'm an ally of You're manlets. An ally to short people. These poor fucking guys, get these goddamn thirst traps out of my YouTube recommended! I'm tired of these pole vault videos, man. They're always in my YouTube recommended section. It's unfortunate. <laughs> Stop simping! Take our freedom! Are you trolling right now? In the air. I'm very serious about this. This is America, people! You know Kira Augustina? I don't know. You can still find the clip. Supertangas.com. Howard Stern said she had the pretty much the best ass ever. You have to see it to believe it. Still nice 15 years later? Probably not. Probably not, but that's why I say that's why I say circa 2005. Oh, it was all natty. Argentinian all natty booty. Well, now, do you believe all this stuff or are you just an idiot? Ah, uh, both. So you're an idiot, is what you're saying. No, no. Well, yes. We're yeah. taking an opportunity. Yeah. yeah. No, actually, enable me. Enable, enable, enable me, please. <laughs> Sir, enable I'm. How about, try to hit me. Why would I? Maybe, maybe you're. I'm not, I'm non violent. I'm a patriot, sir. No, you're just stupid. I'm a stupid patriot. That's true. Well, at least you're an honest stupid patriot. Honesty is the best policy, except for disclosing uh, venereal disease. I don't. I try not to be honest about that. But. Well, you know, you don't want to give it away. You know. And the simps. And the simps. And the simps. Simping is a mental illness. You should be committed to a fucking mental hospital if you dare even spend a dollar on OnlyFans, you cucks. That E thought did 9 11. Gamer girl bathwater melts steel beams. You know, I come from the Netherlands, first country in the world. Ooh, I. Gay marriage. Do you speak Dutch? Yeah, I've been eight months. I love Amsterdam. Right, okay. That's my favorite city. Okay. Are you with this group? Why don't you go get Where's Caden? Freedom of speech, sir. Well, yeah, Why you tread? Don't tread on me. Oh my God! Freedom of speech. Wake up! All of you Americans, you are losing your rights. What does have, that mean? Have you ever played the N64 game? No, I haven't. So Odd Job, this smaller character, so his hitbox was smaller. So in multiplayer mode, it was unfair to the other players if you picked uh, Odd Job. Okay, so that's pretty esoterical. How many people are going to get that message? What are you trying to, what's your message? What's your overall thrust? I saw this. Wake up! Do you believe in equal pay for equal work? Yes, absolutely. Men are being underpaid on well, OnlyFans. You know what? That's 18 not year the old issue. women. Hold on, let me but just say this. That's not the issue. We're 18. not demonstrating against those issues. We're demonstrating. Against, I am, though. No, oh, you are. But I am. This is, we have a different. We have a different cause here, and that is for. But I wanna, I wanna piggyback. All jobs that put food on the table matter. They pay for medical. medical Men on insurance. OnlyFans matter. No, they're not. You got these 18 year old women. They can pay their rent just by taking the shitty iPhone pictures of their butthole, and I don't think it's fair. This is the pressing issue of our time. Yes. Well, it is not. I'm offended. Amber Heard is a nasty Amber Heard is a nasty cunt that falsely accused 
Johnny Depp of domestic violence, she actually took a shit on his bed and chopped his fucking finger off. Fuck that bitch. But I was hitting you. It was not punching you. Babe, you're not punched. Don't tell me what it feels like to be punched. No, when you fucking have a closed fist. You get punched. You got hit. I'm sorry I hit you like this. But I did not punch you. I did not fucking deck you. I fucking was hitting you. That's the difference between me and you. You're a fucking baby. Because you start you physical are such fights. You're a baby. Because Grow you, the fuck up, Because you start Johnny. physical fights. I did start a physical fight. Yeah, you did. So I had because to get the fuck out of there. Do you think that like Leonardo should date older women? <laughs> Let me tell you this. As soon as they turn 25, he dumps them. He has never dated a woman older than 25, and I think it's a travesty. <laughs> Look at last week we had 100. What do you think we got this time? America's waking up. We've had enough. Enough of labia shaming. What about Nelson? He's a great year. Evil. 2021, a great year. Evil. I think we need to ban labia, Plasty. All labia matter. All labia matter. All labia matter. Labia love. Hashtag, hashtag labia love. Women get shamed if they have a large labia. There's terms like, you know, Arby's, beef curtains, wizard sleeve. I'm, I'm a fan of Audi's. Any ladies watching this video that uh, you have an Audi, DM me on Instagram at whatever. Cobra Kai never dies. The Karate Kid, best fucking 80s movie ever made. Best 80s movie. Best 80s movie. Do you like the Karate Kid? And don't threaten that woman. I didn't threaten her. You sure did. How did I threaten her? You just pointed your finger at her. I pointed. Started yelling. Don't well, I, I'm her. sorry. I shouldn't have pointed. Thank You're you. right. Then you are on. right, sir. Then move on. I apologize, sir. Move on. Please don't use the F word. You're right. I should be more graceful. But you like the Karate Kid? That's a good movie. Daniel LaRusso. I mean, he's fucking legend. You and me, buddy, we're going to smash the matriarchy. Well, you might, you might help. Smashing the matriarch by taking that dumbass mask off. That mask does no good whatsoever. I do not like seeing people, especially men, wearing masks. Mm. Well, how do you know? Go, rah, how do you know I'm a man, though? <laughs> yeah. Did you just assume my gender, sir? <laughs> Are you a snowflake? Is that what you're saying? You're I'm a crazy. beautiful snowflake. <laughs> These feminists have like this crazy conspiracy theory that there's a patriarchy, the evil patriarchy that all men are oppressing women and oppressing women in the US, hello? The patriarchy is fake news. The matriarchy, we live in a gynocentric society. Women can't be drafted. World War I had just ended. These bitches, oh, that's the, uh, these the bitches got the fucking vote. After, of course, after World War I, one of the most fucking terrible war. How many women throughout all of human history have ever got trench foot? Yeah, right, right. been through mustard gas. None. Yeah. Well, you know, smash what? the patriarchy. I'll, I'll I mean, you. the matriarchy. Hey, I'll tell you another story. Rip Ziz. Rest in peace, Ziz. The fucking most aesthetic sick cunt to ever live. I went through calculus class without a calculator. Have you tried that as a delicacy? No. Don't it's mind. actually like pretty yummy. I heard, I, I've had rattlesnake. I hear it's actually an aphrodisiac. Eh, whatever. They sealed the building and everything was sent to the Armed Forces Institute of Pathology. I believe it. All right, I believe now, it, sir. Now look this up. I'm looking it up. Hazelton Labs changed its company name. Yes. Afterwards. They have been pulling this crap for years. Take the town back. And I'm going to give you my cell phone number and you're going to call me back and say how wrong I am. Not necessary. Yeah. Not uh -huh. necessary. <laughs> uh, autistic fuel like my autism mostly hey guys thanks for watching if you haven't seen my update video youtube is targeting channels like mine for demonetization i don't want to be creatively stifled for the sake of advertiser dollars i want to make what i want to make without having to censor myself that's why i'm asking if you have the means consider supporting me and whatever snag some merch or drop a dono if you don't have the means don't even trip still stoked if you can drop a thumbs up on the video leave a comment i do read them watch my other videos subscribe and turn on post notifications follow at whatever on instagram and twitter share my videos with friends family your pillow waifu whatever lastly if you're billionaire heiress or have large labia slide into my dms all links are in the description Thanks again so much, guys. Frothing to be back. Got a lot of good stuff on the way. Stay tuned.